SBRT stands for Stereotactic Body Radiation Therapy. It's an advanced radiation technique that delivers a few high-dose radiation treatments to multiple parts of the body. And usually because radiation is only delivered in a few visits, it condenses radiation courses from multiple weeks, often just into one to five visits. It's completely non-invasive, meaning that nothing is inserted inside of you. You're not gonna feel anything. There's no heat or burning or pain. And it's essentially just like receiving an X-ray. You'd be laying flat for the treatment. We would try to get you in a very comfortable position so you could lay still for at least 10 to 15 minutes. And then the machine would rotate around you so you wouldn't feel a thing during the treatment. When you're planning SBRT to various body sites, it really depends on the site that you're treating and how we set you up for that treatment. But essentially, what you would do is you would come and see us for a consultation. We would do a radiation planning scan to ensure that we could deliver the treatment appropriately. And once we decide that you're a good candidate for it, essentially we would do the radiation treatment planning, um, bring you back for your first visit, and then essentially start the treatment and make sure that you're comfortable through that whole process. For the most part, stereotactic radiation or SBRT is fairly well tolerated, but depending on the area of the body that you're treating, there could be some specific side effects that we would discuss in more detail uh, at the time of the consultation. So for the most part, SBRT provides very high control rates of the cancers that we treat. So for example, if you treat a lung cancer with SBRT, oftentimes there's more than a 90% chance that that tumor never grows again. But of course, um, in different body parts and for different cancers, there can be varying control rates. But for the most part, SBRT is what we call an ablative therapy, meaning that the target or tumor that we treat, the majority of the time does not grow back after treatment. SBRT can be used for a variety of cancers. Usually SBRT is used for cancers of the body, so things like lung cancer, kidney cancer, prostate cancer, and for cancers that have spread to different organs, for example, to the bones or the liver um, and to multiple other sites throughout the body. So in some cases, SBRT would also offer an alternative to surgery with very similar control rates. So for example, in patients with lung, prostate, kidney, or even liver tumors, SBRT can offer alternatives to other more invasive treatments like surgery or um, other ablative uh, techniques.